Once upon a time, there was a farmer in a small village. He had a piece of wonderful cropland. Once, he planted his crops in that land and the crops grew very quickly. In a few days, a parrot built a nest between the crops. After some time, the parrot laid eggs in the nest. Soon little parrots came out of those eggs and started to live happily with their mother parrot. The parrot used to go daily in the forest to feed her little children. One day, when she came back from the forest, she found that her children were very scared. She asked them, What happened in my children? Why are you so scared? They said, Mother, farmer came here today, and he was talking about harvesting. He was saying, Tomorrow he will send his sons to cut the crops. Then they said, Mother, where shall we go after crops has been cut? We are not even able to fly right now. After listening to her children, the mother parrot said, Don't worry, my children. Nobody will come tomorrow to cut the crops, so please, don't be afraid. The next day, it exactly happened as the mother parrot said. No one came there to cut the crops. Many days passed like this, but no one came there to cut the crops. Everything was going well, and parrots were very happy. One day, when the mother parrot returned from the forest again like the before, she was again shocked to see her children's faces. They were so scared, again the mother parrotisked them, the reason behind their fear. They said, Oh mother, farmer came here today, and he was talking about crop harvesting again. Today he was saying, Tomorrow he will send the laborers to cut the crops. After listening to them, the mother parrot gain said, Don't worry, my children, no one will come tomorrow to harvest the crops. The next day, the same happened again like the first day as the mother parrot said. No one came there to cut the crops. Many days passed like this again. One day, when the mother parrot came back from the forest, her children told her that mother. Today the farmer again came, and he was talking about harvesting crops like before, but as usual we know that. No one will come here to harvest the crops. Then the mother parrot asked them to explain the whole incident. The children said, Mother, today the farmer came here again, and he was talking that he has wasted a lot of his time on depending upon others, and he said that tomorrow he will come to cut the crops by himself. After listening these, the mother parrot got for it, and she said her children that, We will have to leave this place immediately, and make our nest on some other place, because tomorrow the farmer will definitely come for harvesting crops. The children said, But mother, the farmer has been saying this for the last several days, but every time, no one comes for harvesting. Why are you sure that this time farmer will come for harvesting? The mother parrot said for the first time, the farmer was dependent on his sons to complete the work. The second time, he was dependent on the labors to get the work done, and when you depend on others to get your work done, your work can never be completed. But this time, the farmer has decided to do it himself. Therefore, tomorrow, he will definitely come and harvest his crops. The children were able to fly by now. They all flew away from there and made their nest in another place. The next day, the farmer came to the fields and started harvesting. But by then, the mother parrot and her children had left the field. Dear viewers, if we see in our lives, we will find that those who are always dependent on others for their work, their work is never completed. In fact, relying on others for your work is actually laziness. But it also does not mean that you should not take anyone's help. It is not wrong to ask for help, but if one wants to start any work or do it on time, then that work should be done by oneself, because self-help is always respected, and others also help those who help themselves. But it is not right to be completely dependent on others for your work. Therefore, if you have any dream in your life, never depend on others to fulfill that dream. Instead, do it yourself, and you will always be successful. One. Thanks for watching the video. Please subscribe my channel.